everybody, welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy XV. You're back with uh, your hosts, Phil and Dom. I'm here too. That's why I said Dom. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I just wanted to make sure, like, because they didn't hear me say Dom. I said Dom. But, like, you know, I just I just wanted to make sure, like, hi. Hi. I'm actually currently in the same place. He's here. As you. Yeah, he's here. Yeah. Oh and now we're fighting. <laughs> oh, wait, I forgot. I don't have any weapon. Yeah. Okay, well, let's go. <laughs> Dodging, you know. For if you can dodge a, a sand gun, you can dodge a ball. Sick, son of a bitch. Demons. Dodge wrench, you can dodge a ball. You can dodge traffic, you can dodge a ball. That movie, I love it. Love it. Oh no, no, the best was. I think you're the one because the quest mark is on the left. Jump, <laughs> hop, skip, and jump over the sand gun. Good. I would have kicked all their asses. Don't you worry about that. So is that like the one ring to rule them all? Is this? I, it, I, it's I, the ring has been in the Lucius family for like ever, per, and it's what basically controls the crystal and gives the the royal family. The power. I'm pretty sure this scene was ripped straight from Lord of the Rings. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like mm, goes invisible. Yeah. One ring to rule them all, you know, Lord of the Rings. <laughs> yep. Down this hall like a badass. Complete. Oh, complete. And the lone sand gan. Alright. Bring the Lucy I Arcana encompasses three powerful spells. The first of these is death. Oh, first, yes. <laughs> Wonderful. Drains the life force uh, to restore her own. Oh, please be cool looking. Yeah. Oh, it makes them wither. That's so cool. Ooh. Cool. Can I? Can I use that on, uh, Dick Face Mike's to get to the top. top? He's immortal, though, that's the thing. And then that means I can use that on him forever. I get a very big Final Fantasy VII vibe from this, like, structure. <laughs> we, we gotta get Final Fantasy VII remastered. Whenever the fuck that comes out. <laughs> just happened dude i was like okay you know we're making some glitter you know this is fine this is okay and then just like all enemies deleted <laughs> holy shit like they are erased from this game's memory they they do not exist any longer what the f do you see that yeah i saw that flying through whoa oh hey it's definitely <laughs> come to save us <laughs> all right dom favorite zelda game go uh, you put me on the spot, man. <laughs> they already know mine. Twilight Princess. <laughs> might be Twilight Princess. I think, I think it might be Twilight Princess. Uh, but which, which version? Dead quiet. Uh, I played on Everybody GameCube. Go. That's my preferred version. I think it's it, it, the right version is on the GameCube. Well, well, because of the fact that it, he's holding his sword in, in his correct hand. And the game isn't completely flipped. Yeah, it's Mirror oh, World. I, it, it's it's like Master Quest, Ocarina of Time. Oh, okay. Let's let's delete some more enemies. Jesus Christ, this is dope. Deleted! I feel like this is what would actually happen if Reboot was a thing. And, like, it was actual like, awesome game. <laughs> but then again, I really liked Majora's Mask. No one ever talks about the Game Boy games. Again. 
Like I really liked uh, Phantom Hourglass. That was fun. It was the DS version. Yeah, Phantom Hourglass City was fun. Minish Cap chills. was so much fun. Never played it. I have it on my like Game Boy Advance. I still have the original case. I'd play it. All right, Phil. Favorite Pokemon Take game? Go. Oh, yellow. Comfort. Yellow. Only because of the fact How that it followed the anime or the cartoon, whatever you want to call it. A little bit, yeah. More or less. Um, can't help you but if I had to like if you can't help really yourself. pick a favorite, it would have to be uh, Pearl. It was Generation <laughs> Four. Hurry and yeah. Find them. Um, only because of the fact that I left the Pokemon series at Generation Three. Only because of the fact that I didn't have a Game Boy Advance at the time, and I kind of fell out of it. And then when Generation Four, when Black was coming out. Uh, a, my cousin came over and said he was cleaning some dude's car and for, for, for work yeah. and he found this, this DS chip and he knows that I had a DS loading. so he brought it over <laughs> and, I'm, and, I'm, and he's like I don't know what game it is because the sticker's not there Okay. so I popped into my DS and it was Pokemon Pearl and I was like that was fucking cool so he's like yeah dude you can keep it I don't, I don't care I don't play Pokemon or whatever I don't even have a DS so I was like alright cool, cool shit. and it got me back into the series a generation 4 is my favorite generation uh, if that reason only like it got mm. me back into the series Nothing here. We have Pokemon Crystal for sure. Like, uh, okay. Jump scare. Like, uh, I, I think my first Pokemon game was Silver, and then I, I don't know why, different about but like I got it for like it was the off. first game for Game Boy that I ever got, and then I got Crystal like next year, and I absolutely loved it. Like, I don't know why I loved it more. Really, because like you can catch Suicune, and it's like it was like. I think that's one of the, special key. the main reasons why I love Pokemon Yellow so much because I remember vividly, I, I remember this day, it was Christmas Day, I was, okay, I can't remember, I think I was at least seven or eight, and I got my, oh, fuck. Yo, when did this become a horror game? <laughs> he, uh, <laughs> oh, you can save here, and you can rest too. Um, yeah. It was, it was, yeah, it was Christmas Day, I was like seven or eight, and I, my parents bought me a Game Boy Color, and I still have it to this day. It was the special Pokemon edition, uh, special Pokemon Pikachu edition, Game Boy Color. So it had the yellow front and it's got the blue background or uh, blue backplate. Yeah. And it's got on the screen it says Pokemon Color or sorry Game Boy Color and it's got a Pikachu and a Pichu, and it's got a Jigglypuff. you running around here. Uh, uh, like as the art oh, on yeah, the sides. Yeah, and and the power is actually a Pokeball. So mm -hmm. whenever you turn the power on, the the, the red, red like, in the yeah. center of the Pokeball turns on. I remember that. And the first two games, I saw you. And the first two games I had ever gotten were Pokemon Red and Blue, and and then Pokemon Yellow. Okay, three games, sure. Uh, Pokemon <laughs> Red and Blue and Pokemon Yellow. And I was playing Pokemon Red, and I got five minutes into it, and I got my my uh, uh, Squirtle. But then I saw the uh, Pokemon Yellow, and then it had Pikachu, and it said Special Pikachu Edition. So I was like, okay, cool. I booted that up, and it gave me Pikachu. And I was like, this is so awesome. I got Pikachu <laughs> right off the bat. And I played the rest of the game like that. And yeah. that's one of the main reasons why I loved uh, Pokemon Yellow so much. And why I, I think it's my more heartfelt favorite. Oh, God. Oh, he sucked. It's fine. I swear to Christ. He's just going to leave. If he leaves. He <laughs> These things are so dumb. I love it. <laughs> I'm trying to think of other series now. That's funny. Speedruns of Pokemon Yellow don't. <laughs> they just like, ah, oh, there's Pikachu. We don't need him. We're just gonna throw him, the... <laughs> just throw him into the. throw him into the PC. It's actually faster to throw him into the PC than keep him in your party throughout the rest of the game. Because, like, you'll make, like, a Pikachu sound and, like, you'll throw him up. And he'll be following you and throw him up to the Pokemon Center whenever they need to use it. So it's actually faster to just throw him in the PC. Yeah, I get it, yeah. And the Nitto ran, because they use Nitto King Field to run. It's actually quicker to nickname him, like, one letter, A, just so, like, because of all the text boxes that, like, pop up afterwards. Are you serious? Yeah. So, it, like, throughout the whole game, it's actually faster to name him A. <laughs> why are you gonna min- I get it, but, like, why are you gonna min-max all that shit? Like, no. Because, like, gotta go fast. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's another favorite series? Uh, favorite Fire Emblem. Oh god damn, that's gotta be uh it's gonna be Oh, oh Propta! Whoa! I love Jesus. Fire Emblem Propta! <laughs> Fire Emblem Propta. <laughs> Uh Radiant Uh Radiant Dawn. Uh Mine is Final Final Fantasy. Mine is uh Fire Emblem, I think it's seven in Japan. But it's it, like 
My favorite Fire Emblem game is Final Fantasy Tactics. <laughs> yeah. uh, I, th I, th I think it's called Final... Uh, fuck! Shit! <laughs> I think it's called Fire Emblem 7 in Japan, but f in America it's just called Fire Emblem. It's the one with Lin yeah. and, and, and uh, Elwood and shit. I love that game. And Sacred Stones, That th those two games alone... It, oh. oh, I beat the I played and beat both of them. They're so good. The, 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 fi the Fire Emblem... Sacred Stones is a little bit easier, I think, than Fire Emblem. Oh yeah, like the buzz and like, the, the, the number seven. It's it's I, generally harder because I remember going to that last. <laughs> fuck this game. But oh, there you go. Oh, oh my god, it saw me. <laughs> I was in a mute forever. <laughs> okay. This isn't. This isn't gonna be terrifying in any way, shape, or form. I think I figured out another one. What? Favorite episode of Dragon Ball Z. God damn it. Help <laughs> me. The, the one, uh, it's not even, it's not an episode, but the episodes where Gohan destroys Cell. I was going to say fighting. the exact same fucking thing. That was the best. It's it's like those three or four episodes where it's, it's that fight with Cell, and then the specific two of them, or three of them, where Gohan is actually fighting off Cell and shit. Oh, it's such, it gives me tingles every time I think oh, of the episode. It. I think, I think Dragon Ball should have ended Dragon Ball should have ended. I like the Majin Buu arc. I hated how it made uh. Yeah, Gohan was Gohan. Bitch. Yeah. Because of his mom. His mom was like, I don't want him to be a Z fighter anymore. I want him to focus on studies and become president <laughs> and become a lawyer <laughs> or a doctor or something. Oh hey, you you got real close. I he was, oh, was like so yeah. powerful. <laughs> Dude, I'm pretty sure he was more powerful than he, his dad. <laughs> he was more powerful than his dad. Oh. Oh, did you just get petrified? I think you just got petrified. Oh god, what a, what a... Are you still using your ability though? No. <laughs> like, you're petrified and I feel like you're still using your ability. I think oh, you need god. a needle. Pull the needle. Yeah. Okay. Oh no I don't. You're not petrified. That is oh, not you're petrified. stopped, that's why. I'm stopped. Yeah, yeah, and she used stop on you. What is stop? Uh, I don't think you can actually... Wait, hold on, go to remedy? Uh, oh. You gotta wait it out. That's all it is. Yeah. yeah, you were totally still casting. Uh, the animation was still going, but I don't think I was still casting. Yeah, Just keep on holding. Keep on withering away. It'll be good. Look you, at you, bulimic spider. <laughs> wow. wow, that was good timing. <laughs> no, actually, that was bad timing. I got hit. No, I know. <laughs> after but, I healed, so. But she, it's like when she went to go attack you, she broke because she doesn't eat. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I like food. <laughs> okay, okay. Hundred bucks says Prompto isn't there anymore. Oh, I'll take that bet. Hundred bucks <laughs> says it's a robot in his place. Oh, Prompto's still there. <laughs> huh. What did I say? Okay. I'll take your money now, thank you. Yes, Another okay. trick. Buy yourself one. something nice. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Yes. You're not getting your debit card back. <laughs> I know. Just yeah. so unfair. <laughs> okay, when he laughs like that, I swear to Christ, he sounds like Lex Luthor in Superman 64. Let's not bring that game up. Okay, no, that's my it's my favorite game of all time. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Love my Superman 64. Pretty sure he collected more rings than Sonic in that game. There's a, oh hey, there's a. You're still, yeah. still. I, oh, I I guess I didn't mash B enough. <laughs> there's a video series that uh, Proton John did on YouTube, and it's on Superman 64. I don't know if he's finished it yet. It's been around for like I think three years. Oh yes. And I think he stopped doing it for a year, and then uploaded an episode like maybe four months, five, five maybe six months ago. And he's still, still not done. Proton John, what the hell, man? <laughs> <laughs> Calling you out. Um, Where's the Superman 64 stuff? I saw a speed run of Superman 64. It was like two hours long, and every time I clicked to like... Like, like, like move like, ahead progress, of it? Like, get progress in the video or whatever. It was like... Like, it was just collecting rings. It was just flying through rings. Nothing yeah. else. Well, because there, I think there's more uh, ring stages than... Uh, than actual Anything action else. 
But it, it was funny because every time Proton John would end the video, it would always end with like the Sonic theme. It was like dun, 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 and all the rings would be tallied up that he's collected since he started. <laughs> oh god. It, get, it gets high, dude. <laughs> that's that's pretty funny. I suggest you take the central elevator. Like sometimes like at, at the beginning the stages are like a minute long or something like that. Thirty seconds a minute long. And then later on stages become ten minutes long. Aren't you? Oh yeah, they're like to fly insane. to these bloody rings. He's like, Are you serious? Oh yeah, this is actually horrible. What is this shit? Ah. Well, that game is long, like it just pissed me off because it it, it it could have been done better, but mainly because of the fact that uh, DC Comics, I think, move. was the one that really had a big issue with Superman punching real people. Huh. Yeah, go figure. Huh. So that's why they ended up changing it to be like the shadow clone things, whatever it is. And everything took place in like an artificial world, not actually on like planet Earth. Yeah. I wonder how long it'll take to death this thing down. <laughs> Let's try. <laughs> Wait, his sword's gone. Yeah. His sword is gone. And yet, yeah, it's, it's still going through animation. So it's so funny. Oh my god. So funny. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, he's the cop guy right now. Look at those four arms. Hey. How long did that take? <laughs> uh, uh, from the beginning of the fight, that was two minutes long because our timer just went up. <laughs> well, that was a nice little end to the episode. <laughs> yeah, and you know what? We were totally going to end it there because that's just an epic way to end. Yeah. <laughs> the epic fight of draining a freaking. Jeez, that was awesome. Gargantua. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. If you liked it, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. What? Oh.